Tonight, police stormed a stream of high school and locked down campus after a report of a parent with a gun. There was no gun, but instead a parent frustrated by what she describes as repeated attacks on her daughter. News 2's Abigail Whitten reports. Michael, Sylvia, Lakeisha Lewis, the parent at the center of the lockdown, said she's trying to protect her daughter. Lewis says her daughter, a sophomore, has been jumped twice in the past week by seniors at Estruma High School. They assaulted my child last week, okay? I felt safe enough to let my child come back to school today. She's been jumped by three boys amongst girls as well, seniors. My child was left with a black eye, bust nose, both of her lips were bust last week. He only got three days suspension. Lewis's main concern is that the students who abuse her daughter are still in school today, despite her daughter being sent home. They're putting us out, but the students that attack my child is still inside the school. It's not fair at all. Lewis said the attacks are related to the murder arrest last week of friends of her daughter's. Residents near the school said the episode left them uneasy. This is this is almost like a weekly occurrence. I don't feel safe at all. Pretty dangerous. Baton Rouge is a dangerous place, you know? And uh, you just get used to it, I guess. That's all I can say. Holden says he hopes for a larger police presence near the school. Lewis just wants justice for her daughter. And my child has not been safe, not once, since she started this school. School system officials said they couldn't provide any information about the attacks on Lewis's daughter or any resulting discipline. Live in the newsroom, Abigail Whittem, WBRZ News 2.